you know, um, issue we had, that he um, put an ad in the paper for a part-time counter clerk one day a week. Yes. To substitute for and to just be there. Are you making that a motion? Yes. I second. Oh, excellent. All in favor? Now, we have to vote for chair and vice chair, so. I make a motion we keep the um, officials as they are. I second. All in favor? Is there any discussion? Oh, discussion? Then, no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, can we vote for her? I guess I can vote for you. Yeah, yeah we already did. Okay. Okay. Yeah. 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 Who's taking it? Sure. Chicken, chicken. Chicken, chicken. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, you have some more in for us? Yeah, but I want to see the... I want to make sure that's on there. Is that still here? Yeah. Okay, so do I have a motion to sign the warrants? Or I so motion to sign the warrants. Second. Okay. All in favor? We'll do it. Okay, so Rachel, oh, Rachel oh. and who made the second, Tony? Yes. Okay. Is that a yes? Yes. Okay, very good. No problem. Thanks, Suzette. Yeah. We'll be on Quaddy TV later today. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. So moved. Second. All in favor? Yes. Where is it? What? I don't know. Mm -hmm. I got them at home. I got them. I don't think. <coughs> Do you have my copy? I don't see anybody's copy. I'm going to go in there. Is it in the box? It's okay. I don't know. It's all very good. So, John? So, and the results of the election. So this is why is because we don't know yet. Mm -hmm. No, it's not because the No, I want to know why there's no one in here if the election is happening. I know, but that's what's not in here. So do we have a motion to accept the um, the voting tally of August 2nd? Second. All in favor? Oh, okay. Election results, selectmen, assessor of the the four, Joanne Case. MS 8019, Board of Directors of two three-year terms, uh, uh, Rihanna TV and Crystal Woods. And we have uh, yet to announce the Board of Director for the MS 8019 two-year term. Budget Committee, we need to appoint someone, right? Yes. So we'll have, well, 
up on that. Go back water district trustee one two year term that was good. Is that it? All right. Congratulations. You have your work cut out for you. And as, as for the school board, hold on to your bootstraps. We'll be working together, hopefully. Good things are coming. And now we need to accept the minutes for the town meeting of August 3rd. Here it is, I found it. Do I have a motion to accept the minutes of our town meeting of August 3rd? Second. Do I have to say what's Second. very smoothly? Second. 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 Well, was pretty good. Oh, all it was wonderful. Yeah. That was fantastic. I thought we should have I, I have compliments for next time. I remember that. Yeah. Yeah. We need to approve the minutes of the August 8th Selections meeting. So moved. Second. All in favor. All right. We did do it. That was our week now. We did the election results. That I already did that. Yeah. Right. <laughs> Public Works Garage update. Well, the footings have been poured and tested and they came out fine. We're working on the frost wall. The garage uh, <coughs> parts to the, the prefab steel garage have been delivered. Were they, and were they in fact delivered right on time? Right on time. We secured the location. And we are working on a time frame so that we will stay in our scheduled time. So we are now working on whether the building is going to go up and then the slab, or the slab and then the building. When we have that straightened out, we are moving forward. And then we will have, we have to, of course, have the concrete set because there will be very heavy trucks on there. So uh, from what I understand with concrete testing, they tested 14 days, then they tested 28. If it passes the 14-day test for the pounds per square inch that has been um, recommended for us, 2,000-pound truck, then we can go ahead and, and use the cement slab. If it doesn't pass the 14-day test, you'll have to wait for the 28-day test. Am I right on that, Tony? Yeah, sure. i got a crash course on that today. Oh, <laughs> Jackson. Yes. So that's... Uh, that's it. That. Yeah. Uh, we yeah. had a nice quick little run on that subject in property. Uh, I've had a request from a few people regarding the people looking to perhaps some plumbing on the west side of, of, what? of, of what? the uh, property there in regards to the airstrip. Might, that might be something uh, we could ask for. In, I don't know, on or, the airstrip? Or, Who yeah, just the west. Airstrip? There were Two two pilots came up in that. Yeah, yeah. Look into that. That's that's it, just that's nothing nothing major. Just some. No, several pilots have said it, yeah. it because okay. it's a very quick. They asked you that, John. Mm -hmm. I, they may have, but they came uh, to me. They were getting ice cream. I'm what? bringing it out to. Uh, okay. All <coughs> important things have that the ice cream stand, right? I think right. so. You know, uh, last year uh, we, we did some work uh, mm -hmm. on the approach. Yes, yeah, we did. The east side and the west side. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we did. Yeah. Now I may have my compass off, but I believe it was the west they were asking me to just be a little, nothing nothing crucial, but I think they'd feel more comfortable. No, no that's it. On the flat down. Is it on the approach or the runway itself? I believe mm -hmm. it was the approach, but I, I will speak to you later. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. So you want that on record that you yes. asked? Mm -hmm. That's correct. Okay, John, you don't feel great. Thank you. Pay attention, okay. please. Yeah. Sorry, it was a sidebar. Sorry. We had a meeting, uh, we had a chance to sit down with Coy Creek. Uh, they were the company that had been on doing the whole project. Uh, we had a discussion, uh, the price came in well above what we had. Uh, I have since uh, been given a different, uh, another quote. Uh, it's down a bit. Uh, we thought it was in cost change, it wasn't quite where we wanted it. Uh, but Nick is telling me that he's got some additional funding he wants to add to this project, and I have an email with his recommendation I'd like to read it to the board. Oops, yeah, I think you're going to have to read it. Yeah, 
I think Dave would like that. Do you want to summarize this too. for us? Yeah, basically it said uh, he's got a top end price from Nick at Amex, and that's the uh, engineer, to accomplish mm -hmm. what they need to accomplish, people back in good graces with the EPA and DEP, and the Army Corps as well. Uh, also look at the top end price in Quarter Creek, and we can make this project happen with the funds, which will be at the grant. We have freed up from Department of Economic Community Development Group Revolving Loan Fund. I've even included a 10% contingency in my calculation. My advice tonight would be to get the board to give you authority to do two things. One, apply to uh, Department of Economic Community Development Brownfield Revolving Loan Fund for grant funding to cover expenses over the amount of money you currently have available. Which means we have to pay it back. No, it's a grant. Revolving loan? Fund. For grant funding. Oh, grant this funding. This is going to be for okay. grant. I just clarified. And two, provide you with the authority to negotiate a contract with Quarter Creek to do the work. We can then give Quarter Creek the gentleman's handshake to move forward with planning and scheduling the work, final approving and ratification, which should be a formality if such contract would occur at the next board meeting. In the meantime, <coughs> we need to convene a meeting of you, Quarter Creek, uh, AMEC, Foster Wheeler, and me to discuss details of the work to be done in the contract so we can be sure that we are adequately addressing all tasks so you have a contract that protects the town's interest and available funding and gets the job done and completed. Passes must that with all regulatory agencies, including the EPA. I hope it sounds reasonable and confident we can get it done mm -hmm. and have the resources to do it. Basically, I had a talk with Nick. He's got some additional funding he can bring to the table. Awesome. And he wants He's to uh, stop the yeah. Yeah. His, his yeah. recommendation yeah. is to move the project forward. And I'll say so rep representing the board you, uh, the creek, those guys were they're really great. Ones really there. great. They were very supportive of the project okay. and have really, you know, they've as well, stepped up okay. to the plate. And thank they, you. They've today. got a timeline for about eight weeks. And the bottom paragraph says, I hope it sounds reasonable to you. I'm confident we can get it done and have the resources to do it. It also appears we may even be able to accomplish all of this in 2016. Wow. Yeah, that's Good. amazing. Wow. So what do you need from us? A motion? Or all right. The first one. Follow Nick's recommendation. Yes. The get the board to give you authority yes. to do two things. Yes. Okay. We need to apply to the yeah, that is no. I, I think we should do that. Economic okay, so oh. you need a motion. Is that your motion? I John? Mean, yes, I make yes. that a motion. Uh, I make that a motion. Yes. Yes. So exactly yes. as written yes. Yes. in this email. Mm -hmm. At well, one and two. Okay. You want that repeated for your I'd like a copy of the email. Yeah. Here. Okay. And, and I guess I underline the two that we're doing the motion. Okay. Uh, who made it, Joanne? Made the I did. Yeah. Second. Second. I yeah. would actually like to expedite this if we could, because it says um, final approval and ratification would be the, at the next board meeting, which mm -hmm. would be a next additional. But we need to know. Meetings. We need to know the yeah, details. Just so you know, right. just so you know, though, part of the sort of handshake in there is that it was discussed with. Um, Port of Creek, that they are they are tentatively at least keeping our name in the loop for this to start, and they had a 9-1 start date. So that's in pencil. They're already... Okay, oh, so, okay, so it's, it's... And we're willing to get a, select, a special... I'd yeah. like to have us... Okay, all right, if you want to do that, I'll do another one. So it, 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 it is in motion. It is in motion. Okay. Anyway. We'll just quickly need a few minutes. I was just trying to expedite off. it because yeah. I think the main goal right now is to move that historical building yes. over in, you know, yeah. get the foundation done, move the building, get that secure, and, you know, and, and if we run into, yeah. you know, that's, bad that's weather, we can wait until the next year right. to do the right. That is in the 9-1 pencil. Yeah. You know, we, I love the that, we need to get that historical building on site. And, and well, let me ask you mm -hmm. this, John. Do you need approval for this, from this group? I mean, it says we can apply, but... And he says, he says, he said, you know, you can apply and you'll probably get in if he thinks he has money. So Joanne told me to expedite it by allowing the Creek to start. Is there any way we can do that and start the project and then, you know, put a kibosh on it if we don't get it? Or we talked things? about, you know, based upon Maybe. confirmation if you make the call tomorrow to Quarter yeah. Creek. Uh, so we still have to have a sit down with Quarter Creek, Park the Rail, and the next one. I mean, there is some steps. That are going to do. All right. Uh, if you want to wait, but, yeah. I, I, but I did ask yeah. John to call tomorrow, if you can, to Porter Creek and yeah. say, look, you know, I know you have it in pencil. We got to keep it in pencil. Yeah, make a meeting. Schedule the meeting. Keep pushing towards that nine one. Yeah. yeah. Schedule the meeting. Okay. 
and to look at the new video thing. So oh, what's that? Call them right now. Yes. So Tomorrow we morning. Need, we need all, all those in favor since we discussed? Yeah. All in favor. Yes. Sorry, boss. Okay. <laughs> Okay, we're going to do a little authorizing here. of banks. Who owns these? Yeah, typically, uh, what we have, okay. no, this is just a board vote. Uh, the authorization on the bank account. Uh, in the past, we've had the treasurer, the board chair, and the vice chair. We have the authorization to sign checks. Uh, that would be one motion. And then the second motion, uh, that the town administrator has authorization to check balances, but not to withdraw funds. We need a motion. Yeah. We need a motion uh, for the authorization of the bank check. This would be for the treasurer, board chair, and vice chair authorization to sign. I'll make that motion. Mm -hmm. Second. All in favor. Oh, and yet, second one is good use to be able to check out and but not withdraw money. I make that motion. Second. All in favor? Okay, all in favor. 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 May revise statute annotated in section 906 to apply any tax payment received from any individual as payment for any property tax against outstanding or delinquent taxes due on said property in chronological order beginning with the old unpaid tax bill provided, however, that no such payment may be applied for any tax for which an abatement application or appeal is pending and was approved in writing by the taxpayer. Do I have a motion to accept that? As read. So moved. Second. All in favor? Okay. Go. <laughs> Is this the next one? Yeah. Okay, what's that one? I need to see that. Authorizing weekly uh, Bureau of Motor Vehicle Disbursements. Yeah. We, the municipal officers of the town of Lubeck, Maine, upon request of the DMV, an agent of said town, hereby authorize the direct six residents to pursue to PL 6 LD 130 and act to allow municipalities greater flexibility to disperse state fees, permit the disbursement of state fees due from free and the support database. Weekly, <coughs> when the disbursement warrant has been signed by one of, one of any of the five designated municipal <coughs> officers, the warrant will be available at the next regular collective meeting for review. So, anyone? Yeah, there you go. Put Carol, put your Carol Hancock right on there. Oh, second. All in favor? Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> well, we have everybody sign anyway. You can just oh do my my favor and sign. Thank you very much. I don't want to do anything with the <laughs> Too large a check around there. Discuss the employees of board and committee. I think you ran out we were busy making cookies or something, and so yeah. I didn't get some signatures. And Remember? Hmm? I have more appointments. Oh no, I have to go to. There's something that she just has to sign. Yeah. Summer key. Yeah. 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 But this is a new, but we've already done it. No, we're going to. Where are the Weren't there two that needed. Mm -hmm. Oh, they're yeah, all done yeah, again. I've got some here. Oh. Yeah, there were two that needed. Yeah, just mine. I've already done the two. No, we'll, we'll do it again. We're going to appoint this as a slate, and we, I'm going to excuse myself from appointing myself. So, and so I, I would make, I would make a motion that when your name, I'm sorry, when your name, don't put us together again, okay? I no, think not. we don't need to be together. We need to be apart. I think so. As as your name is read. We are just going to assume that all of, all of us are recusing ourselves from the appointment of ourselves. Okay. 
So, Van Wagner, Exxon Development Team, Van Wagner, Carol Dennison, Catherine Cassidy, Mike, the board of the she told me she didn't want to do it. Mm -hmm. Again, with this not to me. Mike, what's my Mike's name? That's not how you spell his name. That's the wrong spell. Denise Little, Mike Tiburado. Yeah. Area Transfer Board Directors Alternate, Rachel Rubier. Emergency Overseer of the Four, John Sutherland. Revolving Loan Administrator, John Sutherland. Emergency Management Director, John Sutherland. Emergency Management Assistant Director, Anthony Canone. Harbor Board, Anthony Canone. CDBG Grant Committee, Joanne Case, John Sutherland, Captain Cassidy. I just wish we had that. It's not even active. We got to have it from my grandfather's uh, grant. We've got office personnel, and they kept it oh. real small. Oh, I think they're going to be scared. Oh, okay. thank you. They're all the same. Thank oh, you very okay. much. Very good. Spike Main Committee, Frank Terrio, John Sutherland, Renee Gray, Heather Cannon, Rose, Kazuba. 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 It's because you sneeze. Kazuba. Yeah. Kazuba. I'm not on that committee. Were you appointed to the appointment? Yes. Yeah, these are supposed to be experts. I think no. I was also appointed to the Economic Development Committee. Yes, right? yes, yeah, but well, you've already yeah. been signed. Yeah, yeah, yeah I did. It's the ones that got missed. missed. Oh, those were the ones that got missed. Okay. Ah. But we'll just put Ooh. Dan on there again just in case you know. Well, put me on the CDBG grant committee. You agree to do it, Sam? Sure. Yeah, miss a meeting and you get That's it. That's it. Joanne? I will. I will know. And, and this is just for the micro. It's for the micro enterprise grant. Just to, just to, to manage the overseeing of some it's of the It's fine. I don't mind. Okay. It's not for any new business. No. Fall festival committee. Uh, no, I happen to know that the fall festival and the pirates are, are being merged. Yeah, you got to change the business. Yeah. So I, it's going to be one committee. Okay. So, so the pirates invasion slash invasion. fall. Yeah, the fall pirates. The fall pirates <laughs> invasion. Yes, the fall yeah. pirates invasion. Perfect. And I think there's. Used to be known as Harvest Hall. Yeah. yeah. Jenny, Jenny Brown and Shirley Brown. And I think there are other people. There's all there. parts. I think it's just mm. one committee. Mm -hmm. We'll have to fix that. Yeah. Fourth of July committee. Wanda Matthews, mm -hmm. Kelly Hall. And that's it. Yeah, we have. And while we're signing all of these. Just give me the bike main update. Do we have a motion for this? Oh, sorry. We need a move. So move. Second. All in favor? Uh, you the board anything? was starting off. Do you want me to bike update? Or you yeah, I want to do the bike update. See, Dan, see, this is the thing. You can't sign your own. Yes. So pack that, that over there. Pack that over there. Uh, bike main uh, coalition uh, gathered this afternoon. Uh, under the guidance and uh, leadership of one Rudy, Rudy Jordan, who's head of the committee, along with Mr. Sutherland and myself, uh, Frankie T, and uh, Ms. Murphy from the school, was representing for the 7th and 8th grade. Uh, huh? And Barbara Frazier representing, representing volunteers. And Rose Kishima. And Rose, bless you. Um, in regards to you know going through the village, making sure that the, the school, making sure that the school facility is up to par and snuff of what they need for these 400 bikers and another 70 some odd volunteers, uh, as well as uh, downtown prepared and all their sort of it's a though it's a one day event, it's sort of a three day whirlwind uh, tour that they come. Uh, they come in with all of their facilities, and uh, they really are a top-notch organization that uh, really fills in all the holes needed to make what will be a very successful weekend. Again, it is Thursday, September 15th. Um, the bikers come in that morning, but Bike Maid comes in the previous evening and sets up with some signage and all. We are going to be. Right we are going to be using some of the, the children as a volunteer basis program. In which case, Bike Maine helps fund and uh, donate some money towards the eighth grade uh, senior group. Um, and really, a great opportunity for the establishment of Bike Maine is to go throughout different parts of the state each year, uh, so the towns can kind of exploit what they have and what they have to offer and. Uh, so we are on schedule, and I think everything from 
all the meals and all the things that need to be done and opening up the town with open arms is all in place and ready to go. Can I add to that? Sure can. We are also... Uh, I can't hear you. Go ahead. We are also working with Eastport to get shuttles, boat shuttles, for all three days. There are going to be two days in Eastport and one day in New Back. And what we want to do is give them the opportunity, whichever town they happen to be in, yes. go back that they can go yes. back to the other one. Lovely idea. So that it makes it more special. Yeah. Any of the other towns they go to, they can oh. get on a boat. Yeah. It's really nice. If I can also yeah. add, I believe, and this would go through Barbara Frazier, whose information you can get at the town hall, they are also still looking for, it's not really volunteers. We're, we're looking for, I think what's left is uh, volunteers for the information booth, a few of them. We're charging cell phones, we can use some people to help with that. Uh, we're also, one of the, one of the uh, new ideas is that we'll have, we would like an ambassador at Stockford Park, at the uh, Lost Fisherman's Memorial Park, to be there playing music, being there just to help if anybody has any questions. So if somebody likes to be an ambassador, wants to be friendly, but get people, tourists that are she's, If she's not working or something, we could reach out to Shelly too. Maybe she might have someone who is very knowledgeable of the history of the memorial. Yeah. Not herself, maybe they could Beautiful, be there. Good. Yeah. But certainly, anyone who would like to volunteer, um, please contact the town. If you don't uh, know Barbara's information, we'll get that to you because it's going to be a, a super event. She just, just keeps going. Though. So did you. <laughs> it comes with a job. Do we know? Do we know exactly where? Um, I heard some controversy about a beer garden being set up. Do we know exactly what's going to happen with that? Yeah, they we're going to go through the uh, right now. The, what did you plan at the meeting, Rita? Well, to they, they came to the meeting and actually John did more for the discussion about the beer garden. Because it's going to be the Lions Club, that's yeah. why. And, and we agreed that it would be held where, where the uh, Marathon had it? Mm -hmm. Yes. In that in Peacock parking yeah. lot? Right. Yeah. That's very nice. Yeah, that's very nice. We don't have all the details worked out, so I can't sign the agreement until it is. Which details? Yeah. Yeah. It is going to be the, the, the Lions the Club is going to do it? Yes, that is not completed yet, but when it is, it'll come across. It's not going to be the until But it is the Lions Club going to be doing it? Yeah. Very they nice. They couldn't do it. They couldn't do it. So, it's, 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 most of that is up to you, John, right? There's only going to be in a couple of days, and then we'll be able to sign it to get back to them. We have to alter the agreement just a little right. bit and split yeah. involved with But the rest of it, I believe, is all attacked. What about the Porta Potties? Did we discuss whether they could have some of the beer gardens? Yeah, we're, yeah, we're going to have some of the Okay, good. Yeah. That would be a good time to do insurance. And the town is taking their part of their second and, and getting the tent with it part of the putting up. A big tent, 20 by 30. 20 by 30. Already, Ruth has already gotten that. I, I believe that actually even paid for it. Pardon me? I think it's already paid for. Good. We already paid for it? Yeah. I'm supposed to say we already paid for it. The town did. So yeah. what, what hours, what hours are we doing? With the money, it's like May game. What hours are we actually doing that? Two to six. Two to six? I thought we didn't have to pay for it. So we picked it up. Then they can go downtown. No, we don't pick it up. They bring it. They bring it. I thought you said we didn't have to pay for it so for a while. So we had between now and then to pay for it. It didn't matter. Yeah, Everybody so had it, was, it, was it all this warm? It was mm -hmm. out of the bike lane money. And you had to pay for it. You mm -hmm. pay for it. Because, because it's a designated bike. I'm just concerned that we pay for a tent for something that isn't finished yet. And we don't have all of the ducks in order and all of the people signed up. Mm -hmm. And we don't have the insurance secured. And we were able to hold it. We did not have to pay for it until it was all together. So hopefully we don't have an empty tent because we don't have it done. I'm just saying. 
I wouldn't have paid for it until I knew that a particular organization was actually going to do a world or a dust in the world. Well, John told me that they were wearing clothes. Well, I okay then. Well, okay, then. by me. Chicken. So, it's all set. Go get them. I'm just saying you don't have it. It's all right. Well, okay. well, Rachel knows where I'm coming from with this. No, so, I, 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 just, I would just be calm about it. Yeah. Thank, okay. thank you, Rachel. Yeah. Not a problem. You're welcome, Rachel. John. Thank you. Yeah, I mean, uh, that's good that we have it anyways. And the same people are setting up the tent for the city are setting up the tent. Yes. Right. And the downtown is not going to be blocked off. Sure. That's correct. And the, the library said that they will be no, open from 2 to 8, Nobody. even though it is a Thursday. Okay. okay. So, so I do believe that the implicit thing there the was library. not the implicit uh, request there. It's not so much the library as the bathroom. Yes. So is yeah. that correct? I think that. I mean, how many bikers are going to do there and check out? You never say anything. It's not check out, but they might want to go in and just sit down for a while. I mean, it's it is quite, a comfortable place. Comfortable. And, and actually, they're setting up the tables and chairs themselves, okay. right, Ruta? In yes. The, in the yes. tent. So we don't have to. We were do talking that about the library here. Yeah. Um, the library, and they also asked about Lubeck Landmark. Yes. So that's pretty much the facility. Do you have a key for that? Um, yes. And, and then there are all the restaurants right up the yes, street. Yes, yeah. yeah. I'm just thinking, considering the amount of beer drinking, it's going to be gone. Um, we should have lots of I suspect <laughs> there'll be a considerable gain in the use of the latrines. Yes. The latrines. <laughs> um, but I do think time. we might caution them on uh, stocking up on toilet paper. Good idea. Okay. Uh, as part of my... Mm -hmm. Uh, <laughs> I was approached uh, if uh, Lubeck uh, had an interest in receiving a couple of bike racks that we could place mm -hmm. in downtown. Yeah, we get to see them. Um, one of the you know places we discussed um, would be like the Rainer office. You know, yeah. Perhaps. Uh, I thought one of the little park. I don't know if it's correct term adjacent to the post office. Yeah, that would be park. Yeah, 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 that would be nice. Yes, yeah. yes. Yeah. And they also, um, I guess they contacted me and DOT about share the road signage. Yep. And the DOT has, uh, I guess, Portsmouth Town. Put them up. Or 181 or 191 coming in check. So we had a vote. Okay. So we need a motion to be bike friendly for yes. the bike racks and the share the road signage. Yes. I would love to make a motion for. I believe we have discussed then two bike racks and some mm -hmm. signage on 189 so that Rebecca can continue to support and be bike friendly. Mm -hmm. All in favor? So, what's that move? Yeah, yes, I mean, second. All in favor? Whatever. We could have um, someone make a big banner like they do for the marathon, the marathon. Yeah. and put it um, maybe out by, by Monkey Tinker yeah. and yeah. say, you know, um, you know, Welcome Bike Maine. Welcome Bike Maine. Rachel, maybe I could. 